everyone, so today I want to talk about the 2013 film Mama. Now I wasn't going to go and see this but a lot of people said that was really good and a lot of people you know, said really praised it and said if you like scary films you have to go and see it. Now I'm trying to make the effort to see more scary films because I enjoy them but I don't watch that many so that's why I decided that I had to watch it. So the plot for this I think is actually really quite exciting and something that really hooked me in. It's about two little girls who have to spend five years on their own in a cabin in the middle of a, in the middle of a forest, in the middle of woods. And the film is not about that as such because they're only really there, we only see that in the film for about a minute and a half, two minutes. It's about them trying to function again in normal society when they go and live with their uncle. But various problems happen immediately which makes it really problematic, primarily the mention of Mama. And the character of Mama is obviously what makes this absolutely fantastic. We learn that when they were in the woods, they created this apparently fictitious mother figure who they call Mama to help them get through it. Kind of like psychological, self-parental guidance, if you like. But in the film, we can physically see Mama occasionally. She's not in it constantly, but we can see her as this kind of entity, very very spiritual, very ghostly, very monstrous and you know somebody who's not very pretty to look at but we don't know who it is and that's kind of the main part of the film it does kind of look at how these children are going to function in society and cope with the real world because um, they're I believe 10 and 6 at this point um, so they're obviously very different, various different stages the 10 year old can cope a lot more than the 6 year old can as you would expect but the main thing is who is Mama? And that really played with my mind all the way through it. I was like, who? That's who it is. That's who it is. To start off with, I was like, yes, right now I think it's the mother. That's who I think it is. And then I was like, actually, no, I don't. And then I started thinking, well, perhaps it is it is just a figment of the child's imagination. So my mind was torn completely over who it is. Um, so it is, it's got a kind of mysterious element to it as well. So that is great. Scare factor, however, not as scary as I thought. Like everybody I talked to was like, "Oh, it's terrifying! It's absolutely scary! You're gonna, you know, you're gonna cry of fear." Not really. As the film progresses, it's an hour and forty minutes. As it progresses, it does get a little bit more scary. And there were moments where I was kind of like, you know, kind of like looking through my hand. I mean, the directing is brilliant. Directed by Andy uh, Muschietti. I'm not entirely sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, and there are some moments where it's like really close up to the camera and you're like, goodness, that is quite scary. But it's not kind of like I want to leave now and go and do something else in my life because I'm too scared scary. So if you are a fan of horror but you don't like massive scary films, don't worry, you're going to be fine with it. I wouldn't say it's for the lighthearted though. It's not something you can go to if you're just like, oh, I don't mind horrors every now and then. You do have to kind of take an interest in it. It's not terrifying, but it's, it's alright. It's also refreshing to watch a film when I don't know any of the cast members. I am an awful person when it comes to selecting films because of who's in them rather than what it's about. I tend to do that a lot. And so it is really great. Cast is absolutely fantastic. The, the younger actors in this are, are brilliant. So I do, I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. It's not as scary as what I was expecting. So if you're expecting to go there to be freaked out, you're probably not going to be. And that's coming from me who is a fan of horror but who doesn't watch them regularly. So I'm kind of not used to that pace and that feeling of being scared, I guess. Um, so if you're anything like me, don't expect to be freaked out completely. But it is a little bit creepy. I personally enjoyed the whole who is mama, what is mama, rather than the whole I'm terrified aspect. So it is good. Go and check it out. Let me know your thoughts. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.